Hey guys, today I want to show you a tweet called iRetina, and this is really only going to uh, be useful to the people with iPhone 4s and iPod Touch 4th Gens, the ones with Retina display. Basically, what sums up this tweak is you use Terminal to apply, it basically uses an algorithm to change your icons to um, a Retina display size. So if you know, if you have a lot of apps, some of them don't have Retina icons, and they really screw up your whole um, home screen because some of them don't look very good and some of them look retina which is like perfect and you have the you have your device and you really want everything to look as good as you want it so here's a tutorial on how to fix your icons um first you're obviously going to need to be jailbroken if you don't know how to just go to their channel and look at the two videos on top which are for jailbreaking your device and I'm going to say that this is not the easiest thing to do. You're going to have to use a mobile terminal. But it is um, it is a fun thing to do. So basically, you're going to need three things from Cydia. First, you're going to go into Sources. And you're going to need to add this one here. Hit Edit, Add, and repo.insanelyi.com. And I'll have that in the description if you can't read it off of the camera. Once you have that, you need to get search things easier. Oops, sorry. I read and you'll see it right here. I read there, and you're gonna need that along with mobile terminal. One sec. And you'll see you can get mobile terminal for the uh, iOS 4. And then you're going to need Erica's utilities, which you can see right there. Once you have those three, you can continue to the next step. Personally, right uh, when I did it, I resprung right now. You might want to do that if it's not working because... Um, to get everything updated so what you're going to need to do is go into terminal and the first step you're going to need to type in a few things so su is the first thing just type in su enter it's going to ask you for a password this is the same password as your ssh password if you haven't changed it or been prompted to save a password for the device it's most likely alpine and uh, i'll have it spelled out in the description, I changed mine, so we're gonna enter mine in. You might want to change it for security sake, and you can see that it, um, it got passed. And now you can type in what you want to type, which is I ret in there. Oops, there you go. I don't even see it, but it just says I ret in there. I'll have all the steps for the terminal in the description if you can't follow the video. Then you're gonna hit enter and you're gonna get to this. Um it's gonna you're gonna get to this menu which is in a different language. Basically each one of these corresponds to a different thing. One of them is getting it, one of them is getting rid of it if you don't want it. I'll have that this translated in the description. Basically to get it you're gonna hit one and then Y. Now it's gonna use its method to change all of your apps into the better um the better icon it might take a little while if you have a lot of apps this is the first time i did it but i tried it out to till here to make sure that it would work so as you can see it's um changing all the icons i have a few hundred apps hopefully it won't take too long and after that basically uh, only uh, you all uh, all you have to do is respring and you'll be done. So that's pretty much it. If this doesn't fin finish, there we go. Um, now it says, do you want to respring your springboard if you hit Y? Oh, respring. I really like uh, doing things with the terminal on the iPhone because it's more creative and it's not just a tutorial which will be like, download this, that's it. You can actually... Um, have to do a few steps so once you got here congratulations your icon should be good and that's pretty much all for the video if you liked it you can always thumbs up if it worked and leave a comment if it didn't and subscribe for more
I'm just gonna wait until my iPhone reboots to show you um, the new icons. You can't really see the Retina display through the camera. Uh, you have to have a really good camera, really good close up, and mostly you can't really see the Retina through the camera. And you will notice this though if you have an iPhone. And I'll show you as much as I can right now. So. Looking through, you can see stuff like the Skyfire app is definitely Retina, and this just looks so great. Things that that weren't, they were all pixely before, have now been fixed. Like um, these two right here, like the line used to be all jaggedy and everything, and now it's perfect. Um, this is a great tweak, and it definitely helped. That's pretty much it. I'm just gonna stop um, fantasizing over this and let you uh, subscribe if you want and that's pretty much it so thanks for watching